So behind me is, you know, this is what you see when I am actually doing my taping. I do two views, either the longer view or the shorter view. This is my shorter view. And uh, so these are some of my favorite wine books that I have. And if I had to pick one, I'd probably pick this one right here, Wine Science. It's such a comprehensive book and I think it's, you know, for the nerd in me, it goes a long way. It is really cool. And uh, I love these bookmarks here. So this to me represents, you know, if I look at this uh, case here, it represents a lot of things that are very special to me and something that I really enjoy having around. And, uh, you know, th these are from New Mexico. I think that's a really cool thing. Uh, it, it is a great store called Mama's Minerals. And uh, as I recollected, if I found something like that here, it'd be super expensive there. It was so reasonably priced that I had to get that. On this shelf here, you know, some, and the reason I want to do this video is some people thought this was a cross right here. It isn't. It's from the First Nations in British Columbia. I really love this. And uh, just a few years ago when I was there, I tried to get something on every trip that I go to to get something representative, maybe uh, made there or something very special that is from that region. And this here is a ceramic coming from Puglia and the Truly, which I got to stay in one of these. This is really cool. Hand-painted ceramic, and uh, you know, it was a little more than I expected to pay, but you know what, sometimes I never think twice about buying these things. If it's, first of all, it wasn't like 100 euros, it was probably like 25 euros at most. And this here is the uh, Barcelo from uh, Lisboa. So these are important to me because it says, I will go back to Lisboa, so that's why I got this. This is really cool. Or sometimes things are given to me, like this, Chili is from my family. This is from New Mexico. So I was just in Champagne and this is a really cool candle. And this is from the producer uh, Louis Vorderer. And here I try to put all the coins where I was just visiting. And uh, so these are, you know, never US coins. They're always coins from somewhere else. So, and sometimes I actually do use them because I'm in a hurry or don't have time or I think it's a good idea to always have currency on hand. So on a trip to Venice, I got this. A uh, glass plate, very mini one, and it's just, it just looks like it's pieces uh, remnant, and it's just this, you know, kind of just decorative piece. And I uh, love Venice, and I look at this and think, okay, I remember where I was and what I was doing. This piece I got in Prague, and I think it's really splendid. I was going to get one here like this, and I thought, you know what, in my travels, I'm sure I'll find something like this. So when I look at this, this reminds me of my trip to Prague. And I also look at the carrier, the vessel this is in. Now this is from Slovakia. I was in Bratislava and uh, I think this is birch or I don't think it's um, uh, oak, but I got that there. And it was at this really cool craft store where I actually bought wine too. That's some really nice quality wines. So when I look at this shelf, this is what it reminds me of. So I wanted to share these uh, treasures with you. Stay tuned for more. You know where to find me. I'm James the Wine Guy on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Pinterest, LinkedIn, as well as Instagram and WordPress. Thank you again for watching today. Stay tuned for more. Salute.